and welcome back to my channel. In this video, as I mentioned from my previous episode, I will be making entremet au citron. So this entremet is made out of lemon and then there is also white chocolate ganache flavored with lemon as well as a sable, also known as shortbread and the biscuit meline. I'm posting this video earlier because I'm just so 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 excited to share this yummy entremet because in my opinion, this entremet is a type of cake that you wanna have some guilty pleasure but also don't want to feel so guilty because it's made out of lemon and it's not too sweet there's a lot of sour in the cake and then to offset the sourness there is the sable as well as the nut lines and this cake is just the cutest cake I've ever seen it also reminds me of like a key lime pie because there is meringue on top of it and there's the sourness with the sable so it feels like a key lime pie tart kind of flavor but it's better because it's in a cake form and it's in entremet. I'm just gonna recap again this is my 2024 baking challenge where I challenge myself to bake every single recipe inside my cookbook by Julia the winner of the Meilleur Patissier 2023 and of course if you would love to see more videos like this click the subscribe button right over there down there or wherever it is right now <laughs> and since i already said that i am stoked and so excited to share this entremet for everyone to watch so let's just get on with the baking
for this part since I don't have a yellow velvet spray so I'm replacing it with a mirror glaze colored in yellow and it works well too but if you have a velvet spray I strongly recommend it because you don't have to trouble yourself to make the mirror glaze but like me if you do not have any velvet spray you can choose this way instead For this part, if you have a blowtorch, it will be much better because you can control the fire. But since mine doesn't work, so I'm using a long lighter so that it is safer for me to caramelize the meringue on top of it. And if you have a blowtorch, please use that instead. And we're done with the baking. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this. Honestly, it is difficult as stated on the book itself that the difficulty level is difficult and I have to agree that it is difficult. Although, I have some tips for everyone out there who would love to make this on Tome. Make sure that the insert of the lemon, it doesn't go out of the uh, ganache because if you take out of the freezer, it will melt even you just put it in the fridge itself. It's supposed to be in side so that when you cut open the cake then it will melt out of the the antome so this is my advice it's not inside the book so that's why i make the failure oh. there but i made a new batch right here and it's perfectly shape and it doesn't melt because the lemon insert is inside the ganache itself so it's not seeping out of the entreme so i would really suggest to make sure that the insert is within the the ganache so you will have a perfect entreme to present to your friends of course we are not gonna dilly dally anymore let's try this cake because my tummy is hungry for some lemon cake The sablé baked perfectly, it's not too sweet and then also the madeleine, there is sweetness in there but you know what, surprisingly, even added with the white chocolate, the ganache is not too sweet it's more sour in my opinion so that is just perfect this is suitable for people who really really loves lemon as well as enjoying with some crunch and some softness from the madeleine so all of this combined together is just the most perfect dessert for the summer or even over the weekend and we have come to the end of this video thank you so much for watching everyone supporting and we are already at episode 11 i'm so excited to share more of my videos there are a few in the recipe books that is uh, an easy recipe so for this i will be sharing in my short videos there will be a lot of upcoming short videos for the easy and more simple baking from this cookbook and i hope everyone out there will be watching my short videos for the easy recipe from the cookbook and my next episode will be gâteau fruit rouge so it's a cake flavored with red fruits even decorated with the red fruits such as cherries raspberries strawberries any red fruits that you can find in the market <laughs>
although this recipe is easy but because it's beautiful so i'm gonna make it into my next episode so i see you guys on my next episode in gato fruit rouge and once again thank you so much for watching everyone share this video with anyone that would love to make this entreme taking some challenge in their kitchen and comment down below if you try this recipe because i would love to hear from everyone who have tried this or even trying to make this don't forget to click the subscribe button hit the like button and don't forget to click the notification bell so you can get notified anytime i'm uploading my videos and see you guys again next time